Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of No Man's Sky. Alrighty, when we left off, we had been trying to expand our base a little bit. Oh, and we got ships coming in. They look like crap, though. Whoa, that one looks interesting, though. Not gonna lie, that one looks interesting. Ooh, that one looks interesting, too. Oh, but some blue. Ooh. And it's black and red. It's kind of edgy. Yeah. <laughs> I said the same thing about a guy's truck that came in yesterday while at work. Also black and red, lifted. You know, edgy. But that's not the point. <laughs> we left off. We were working on expanding the base. And I think I was also working on growing some gravitino balls, which I also needed. For another thing, which, lo and behold, look at that. They're fully grown. It's also been a little bit of time since the last episode, so that might be why. Oh, now it'll let me? Okay. For some reason, it didn't want to let me get the furthest back ones, but now it will. Weird. Whatever. It doesn't matter. Actually, I should gather all of these. Gather all of these up. All right. There we are. And then there. Good. And then eventually there will be other things I have to grow here. More fungal clusters for one. But that will be later. Okay, now we return to the farmer with the Gravitino ball, which we have one. Actually, we have four, technically. I know that sound anywhere. You carry Gravitino balls, do you not? Yes, I do. Ah, it is like greeting an old friend. Let me see them. Truly wondrous work, Traveler. Ooh, you know cactus. And I can easily do it because I have pyrite and cactus flesh. Nice. We have seen so much life in frost and heat, nuclear winter, and toxic wastelands. You should know by now that no world is truly barren, friend, even if there seem to be few signs of life. Take the echinocactus for... I'm, I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it? Echinocactus? Is this like echidna? Yeah. Echinocactus, for example. They are found on otherwise barren worlds, waiting for their moment to thrive. Just think of what they will become in this superior environment. Hireling Osu wishes for me to cultivate eco... Echino... Echinocactus. Sometimes I stumble over my own words, even if I figure out that's the proper way to pronounce it. Okay, accepting anyway. I look forward to the results, friend. I bet you do. And it'll be easy to do. Because I have plenty of space for it. Alright. So gamma wheat is gamma weed is there. And now I just need to build these. Um there. There, there, and there. Ta-da! Not that hard at all. Actually, you know what? Just to get it so it's not showing that marker on it at all times. Cool. Fantastic. All right. And we just wait for that to grow. And in the meantime, we give the Gravitino ball to the overseer here. Secretary. I could have sworn your name was Overseer. Whatever. Secretary McGain. Whatever. I should let the get get on with her business. Oh, I have to have the mission marked. That's stupid. <laughs> it's stupid. It's there. There we go. Expanding the base. Gra gather a Gravitino ball, which I already have. Come on. Are you for real? This is one of the weird, stupid bugs. I have to wait for the mission log to go through everything and then let me re actually do the thing. Did you enjoy your adventure, friend? Your expedition to find our orb? I have waited for you faithfully. There's something about the way Secretary McGain speaks that, for all their kind words, suggests a resentment saved only for the deepest of enemies. 
But they would not have come to work here if we were enemies. Of course not. We are friends. Are we sure about that? The Overseer asks for the Gravitino Ball so they can finish the Starship technology design. Absolutely. As ever, I'm so grateful for your assistance, friend. I was taking a drink and I almost spat it out. Which would have sucked because these things are expensive. Wow! Cadmium drive already? Okay. <laughs> awesome. Alright. Upgrades the hyperdrive's core bounding magnets, preventing rapid disassembly when attempting to reach rare class red stellar body. I, I was about to say that I thought I said that wrong, but it's right. Red stellar bodies. Don't know why I thought that was wrong. User is advised to... See, that word I screwed up. User is advised to access hyperdrive systems via the galactic map. Okay, cool. Have you ever wondered what happens after death, between expiration and rebirth? Meditate upon annihilation. Harvest Mordite from the dead. It is the only way to escape. Aha. Why are we getting existential all of a sudden? <laughs> you know in something I don't. What? Huh? Huh? Okay, since the Overseer arrived, I have had a recurring dream. A nightmare that feels like a memory. Flesh merged with metal. A world of glass that blinks. A planet with green skies and an obsidian moon. A dream where I see my grave. As I snap back to reality, there is a moment before I can shake the image, that wound on the world lingering before my eyes. The Overseer asks me to harvest Mordite, a material found in the bodies of slain creatures. Can do. The Overseer has served me well. Perhaps their task will free my mind from these lingering nightmares. Here's hoping. Oh, I can easily make that. I don't know why you even bothered putting that as a pin. Uh, thank you for telling me to expand the base, which I already know. Uh, do I not have space? Do I, I barely have space left anymore. My goodness. <laughs> Need to get a bigger ship. Uh, I can easily finish this, no problem. Cadmium drive installed. All right. I have no hyperdrive. <laughs> no hyperdrive fuel. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, should put this away, too. Um, there we go. Oh, I have plenty of Mordite, too. Fantastic. Well, that makes that part easy. Um, whoop. Almost overshot it. Uh, get those in here. Fantastic. Get this in here. Fantastic. Ta-da. Where's... Oh, uh, okay. So I had more selenium than I did frost crystals. Okay, fair enough. Never mind. For some reason, I thought I needed to have more. I don't know why I thought that, but I did. Okay. I can sell the rest of these, which I'm definitely going to do. I don't think I have a need for those. At least not yet. Alrighty. Time to sell. There it is. I'll be selling for a mild loss, but then again, what loss? <laughs> Just a little less demand for it. So it is what it is. Cool. I'm I just realized I'm at eleven million. Wowzers. Okay, um, let's check on these, because these should be back by now. Debrief, okay. Ooh, more Gravitina balls. Okay, a lot of units, a lot of units, a lot of units. And a storage augmentation. And a lot more units. Well, I can't complain about that. Two and a half million units. 
Holy tits. Okay. All right. Wow. Uh, I'm making a lot more money than I thought I would. Okay. Uh, wowzers. Uh, this is for the starship, so I might as well put it on there. Starting to think maybe I should just invest in a larger, newer ship. Question is, where will I get one? Okay. Debrief them. Units, units, units. Indium. More units. A lot of units. A lot of units. Chromatic metal. Not too bad. Iridescite. Viking effigy. I was hoping for daggers, but this is fine. All right. All right. And nearly three million units. Okay. Wow, I am fucking rich. Fucking loaded. Oh, boy. Put that there where it belongs. And put this here where that belongs. Put uh, this is farther back than I thought. There it is. There, where that belongs. And yeah, this is looking good enough, I think. I do need to get a lot more of all of these. Radon. And hell, even if I'm getting just radon, I can make it into nitrogen and sulfurine pretty easily. Well, I mean, I say pretty easily. I can just do it off of my. Uh, large refiner here. Hell, even my refiner in my backpack. I could do that. Anyway, not the point. Um, put that here for the time being. And there. What is... Oh! I forgot I was making that. Why I forgot? I have no idea. But I was getting more, I guess. I was trying to make more. Anyway, moving on. Um, can I sell these for decent money here? I cannot because they're made locally. They're good for manufacturing systems, though. Hmm. Interesting. Good for manufacturing systems. Also, there was patterns in time that I needed to do. I need to go to a Viking cartographer in a Viking system. Maybe if I'm doing that, I'll find a... Hopefully, find a uh, manufacturing system. Maybe. Uh, let's try and head to an Atlas station. To that one. Ah, uh, it's outside of jump range. Damn it. This is Gek. That's not one. Oh, pff, hit the microphone on my own headset. Oops. Uh, where is a Viking system? Okay. Let's go enter free look just for the moment. Chromatic warp shielding is needed for that. Okay. I'm looking for something that's in jump range. Wait. Hey, there you go. Unlen 12. Unluen? I'm assuming. Let's go there. That would have the Viking cartographer I'm looking for. There we go. Perfect. Three planets. Economy is construction. Manufacturing work. Demands minerals. Oh, that's a lot of money. Oh, that was 81% markup. Ha! <laughs> Uh, that was worth it. 
It was so worth it. Oh, the demand on Gravitino balls here is even lower, though. <laughs> ah, well. It's fine. It's fine. I'm making money hand over fist. It's fine. All right. Well, I have way too many of these rooms. So you know what? Is there anything in these I should get rid of? This. Okay. So I'm going to move this to over... Oop. <laughs> I accidentally toggled the camera. Just makes it a little more... Oh. Changes the rotation axis. Oh. Interesting. Oh, geez. Okay. You know what? I am not sure what I expected, but it sure wasn't this. Um. <laughs> uh, there we go. Um, that's definitely not what I expected either. Okay. Uh, I, I just want it to look normal. <laughs> Can I just get it to stop doing that? Oh my god. Alright, uh... You know what? Screw it. Let's just delete the thing. There's no reason to have it... Nope. <laughs> Cycled the part. <laughs> I keep hitting the wrong buttons. Why do I do this? Why do I do this to myself? Why? Why am I the way that I... <laughs> okay, let's delete that. And we'll delete this and we'll delete this and in their place we shall do huh that panel there being a pain in my ass but it's fine it's fine you want to know why because it's all Oh, I see. This is throwing that plan off. Okay. So, let's move this somewhere. Oh, I could just have it independent of everything. I could do that, but why would I do that? And I can just have it on a wall right here. Cool. Perfect. And now with That's not what I meant to move. I meant to move this whole thing. Uh, right. Where the... What the... What the... What? 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 I am confused? What did I, what did I hit to make this happen? What did I do? <laughs> what did I do to make this a thing? I am so confused at the moment. Oh, I can change the scale. <laughs> I can make it tiny if I wanted to. Okay, you know what? Screw it. Screw the whole thing. I'll just delete it. There's no point in <laughs> the What the hell was that? Whatever, man. Whatever. It was weird, man. It was so weird. Okay. Uh, anyway. Continue the thing I was doing. Which was expanding this area. There you go. Now it looks less weird. I don't know why. It looks less weird, but it just does to me. Okay. It leaves a much more open space right after I get out of the door here. It's a lot more maneuverable space. I guess that's why I like it? I don't know. I don't know. I don't pretend to understand the musings of my own mind, because quite frankly, I don't understand them. 
Okay, anyway. Moving on, we shall now plot more expeditions since all of our expeditionary crew is back. And we got... Ooh, an industrial expedition that covers nearly 4,700 light years. I'm okay with this. Uh, industrial, 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 and I think that's all the ships I have for that. Okay, cool. That should be good enough, I think, right? Probably. Yeah, it meets the difficulty rating just barely. Uh, you know what? Just to be on the safe side, let's send a combat with it. Question is, which one? Uh, let's go with the Daughter of Gravity. There we go. Ups it a little bit. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I don't have the fuel for that? I don't have the fuel for that. Really? I keep hitting the wrong buttons as well, which is annoying to myself, mainly. Uh, put this back here. Fantastic. Um, hmm. Ah, okay. I needed to make more anyway. So there we go. Up. Oh, I don't have enough tritium to make that work. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm going to have to do more tritium hunting soon enough. Uh, oh, spaghetti -os. Okay, so. Let's go ahead and go back to the thing I was doing. And the next largest one was also an industrial expedition. Balls. Okay. Well, at least the other one's a balanced. Okay. There's that. There's that. There's that. And then the Daughter of Gravity. And send them on the expedition. Away they go. And Anakrai's Path of Triumph. And go without. One expedition is good. One expedition is fine. Alright. Honestly, I could probably expand the farm a lot further if I really wanted to. In fact, why not? Why don't I do that? I mean, there's no reason not to. In all of these rooms, I can just walk through via that path if I wanted to, which I don't really need to. I don't see why not. Yeah, I don't see why not. I might do that in the future. Just to, you know, increase yields or whatever it is I want to do. <laughs> In the meantime, might as well head back onto my ship and then talk to that Viking cartographer that the mission keeps wanting to remind me I can do. Damn it, I wanted to look at those. Bastards. Okay, well... I have a whole lot of units burning a hole in my pocket, and I might buy myself a new ship. If there's anything interesting. System, which there might be. Is that one of mine? It must be one of mine. I think that makes sense. Okay, heading to the space station now. Whee! Oh, oh. There we go silver out of that. Haha. -ha. And this will probably flip me around. Yeah, I had a few. It's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. All oh, the other ships left as I was arriving. It's like school all over again. Everyone leaves when I show up. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Enough of that sad joke. Uh, hmm. You are interesting looking. Ooh, speaking of interesting looking, 
You. Whoa, oh, Jesus. Okay. Alright. Ayadar's prize. Is your name Ayadar? No. Corporal Yugz. Trade bleh, warrior ancestors. Okay. Trade honors, I assume. Whoa. You have a lot of slots on you. It's a shame I don't like the color. Okay. Not too bastard. I was going to see you next. All right. I don't like the color of this one either, but it is interesting looking. It's extremely interesting looking. Only I like the color. <laughs> Will I ever get over my obsession for green colored chips? Probably not. I can almost guarantee not. Is that Theory of the Horizon? Interesting. Also, I have a multi tool slot I should probably open up. Considering I have this expansion slot to do so. Cool. Done. Okay. Upgrade. Proof starship class or augment storage. Let's go with the augment storage. Question is where do I do it? I guess we'll do it here. Just so I can pull basic stuff. And buy myself an exosuit upgrade. Because why not? A hundred thousand units. That ain't terrible. Cool. Some of those noises. Some of those noises are deeply distressing to my brain. Okay. And just watching in case a ship comes in, just so I don't get splattered on a windshield like I almost did last time. Cartographer, you are the cartographer, are you not? Yes, you are. Cartographer Aki. Aiku? Aiku? Aiku. The Viking gestures proudly at the databanks that surround them, screen after screen of geographical charts. Grah! Honorable war against the unknown. Viking. I'm assuming that's supposed to be good with weapons and with something. Something, though, something. Okay, whatever. Ask for help. I ask cartographer A Aiku for help. They point at a map on their screen. They then, towards a depiction of the waypoint towers found at most planetary sites, they seem to be requesting I gather data from these towers. Well, I'm I'm literally on a Viking system game. Okay. I guess I need to restart the current mission and use nearby structures. What? <laughs> How did I get here? Oh, jeez. Oh, God, snow. <laughs> oh, no. I'm screwing everything up. Oh, no. All right. Uh, hold. Okay. There we go. Accidentally dated the video. Oops. Speak to a Viking cartographer. I'm right here. Let's talk to you. Okay. Could you let me do it here? There. Thank you. You let me do the thing finally. Alright, whatever. Grah! Honorable war. Blah, 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 blah. Probe Viking lore. Okay. As the warrior begins their bark, I feel a strange frequency vibrate through my skull. I see a flash of Null's glowing orb behind my eyes. Suddenly, the Viking's words ring clear in my ears. 
Grah, pathetic interloper. Prying into Viking secrets, cowardly spy, I should kill. Grah! But, traveler must be aided. Such is command of Herc. Prove yourself, interloper. Retrieve the words of Herc. Ascend in Viking glory. Then you shall have your words. I will reveal only this. Location of Herc's command is marked for you. Commune with their words. Grah. Okay. I guess I collect a Viking artifact from an ancient room. Prove my honor. Okay. Uh, you know what? Since I'm in a Viking system, let's see if maybe I could buy some Viking daggers or something. I don't know. Maybe go with finishing all of that mission up. Uh, Pugnium. I could at least get that. Wiring loom. I always need to buy these. Wow, that's a lot of money. But it's fine. I need it. Uh, wow, that is a lot of Pugnium. I would be silly not to buy all of it at that price. Alright. Um... Hmm. Hmm. Probably for the best that I get that. Because I've been running low on it for quite some time. Eh, that's good enough, I think. Yeah, I think that's all good enough. Alright, collect the Viking artifact. I guess I shall go do that now. There we go. Open for a bigger ship, but I expanded my inventory in this one, so that'll have to do. Is that? Those are a whole bunch of other capital ships right next to the planet. That is interesting. Oh. Might as well scan the planet while I'm heading towards it for these fleets. Sub Zero Planet. Interesting. I wonder. I was about to say, I was hoping there'd be some of these recruitable frigates nearby. What are you, though? I think you're a combat one or an industrial. Let me inspect. Combat. Lazy crew. Lowers uh, expedition duration, though. Combat Specialist. I mean, I could always use more Combat Specialists. But I think that should be the last one I get. And what do we got here? By keen High Command require we all assist the Interloper. My vessel is yours, should you have it in your fleet. Alright, let's look at what you got going on here. A support ship. Alright. Extendable drills, planetary data scoop, and support specialist, which decreases the fuel cost. Well, can't see why I shouldn't. <laughs> Especially when it's only 3 million units and I can easily afford that. Alright. First support ship gained. <laughs> What do we got over here? I want to know if this is a capital ship. It is not. Oh well. But this one is, and it does look a little bigger than my current. I'm just curious how much bigger. I'm not fond of the color, though. That's fine. I'll live with it. I will eventually be able to get different colored ships. I will worry about that later. Or at least be able to alter the color of my capital ship. Usala. Hell of a name. Usala. Are 
Well, there's those same ships I was commenting on earlier. Just, you know... I missed the stairs. How did I miss the stairs? Whatever. Doesn't matter. Uh, nah, it's not worth it. It's not worth it right now. Let's see what we got on this capital ship before I make any decisions. I might be able to afford it at this point. Maybe. Sprint depleted. Okay, fair enough. It's up to you. Captain Ibaiju. Ibaiju? <laughs> blep, interloper, blep brings you here. Blep to give, blep interloping. I don't understand the rest. No gra. That's all I could understand from the last sentence. Offer to buy the freighter. Let us see if it is even worth it. It is not. <laughs> Not even close. I would be exchanging it for zero units. Nah. Uh. Mm -mm. Nope. Nope. Not happening. Not happening. Sorry. I figured y'all would have a better ship than you do. I'm sorry. I was just curious due to the size of the thing. All right. Now that I have wasted that much time. Alright. Now we head off to the planet that actually has the thing. Which is an unknown planet of high radio source. Okay. Welp. Head over to the planet. Okay, it looks like we're going to have an interception of some kind on the way there, so I might as well just slow it down a little bit. Whoa! Okay. by a passing freighter. Okay, I'll help them. Why not? Destroy the pirates to save the fleet. Well, I can do that. Easily do that part. Aha! Didn't even fire all that much on that one. Alright, let's fly around until I can get a good view of this one I'm targeting. Ow! On the other side entirely. That's not good. I don't want to accidentally fire on the ship. I want to accidentally make them upset. My rocket barrages are doing plenty of damage. To the point I'm not even wanting to do much else. for a blank procedure. Okay. I guess we'll look at this frigate now since we helped them. Yep. Received it has been. Kind of curious to look at that ship. Once I'm done getting landed. There we go. These aren't really worth it at all. Okay. <laughs> oh well, it's fine. 
Let's see how this forget fares, considering I just saved them. At the very least, I can get payment. Nothing else. Ooh, a number of other ships coming in. Okay, inspect. Oh, no, it's not worth it. And we shall go for the payment instead. A, a whole bunch of chromatic metal. And before those new ships fly away, I'm heading out here. Because <laughs> some of those heading in look very interesting. <gasps> Enforcer. Yeah, Congus, it doesn't matter. I want your ship. Give me your ship. Give me your ship. Your ship looks cool. Oh, I can just buy it outright. Uh, it doesn't have as many slots as mine, but it doesn't matter. It looks cool. I want it. I want it for my collection, if nothing else. Thank you. My ship. <laughs> not going to transfer to my ship right away, but the father of the Ongianta. Hmm. Fair enough. Next load in, it'll at least be on my foot instead of sitting here. Okay. Might as well recruit this frigate as well. Are you not gonna allow me to? Come on. Maybe if I zoom out and zoom back in. Maybe. Possibly. Come on. You look like a support ship. I want to have you eventually. There we go. Okay. Let's go for you. Look at you. Rock, rock, rock. Holy tits. Maybe if I hadn't bought the other ship. Wow. Wow. Support specialist. S class. Holy. Fuck, my dude. <laughs> Wowzers. Okay. Um, let's check out the other ones. <laughs> Alrighty. Wowzers. Okay. Um, you seem like you might be industrial. I need some more industrials. Okay. Let's look at your stuff. You will not regret this. You're pretty standard industrial, but that's fine. We'll build you up. We'll build you up soon enough. And you seem like a support class. If I can't afford the other guy, can I, I can at least afford you. Right? Yes, I can. Whoa, that is a lot of expedition fuel cost reduction. For the Ancocks, Ancocks will. That's a hell of an unfortunate name. <laughs> But I'll take it. I am now poor. <laughs> but it's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. Alright. And we shall now get going. The Bike Keen Reliquary. And when we land on the planet, that's when I shall end the episode. Alrighty. Oh, really? Look at that. Not too far away, we have some interesting things. Oh, I have to search for it. Oh, come on. 
Okay. Well, this is going to be annoying. I'm going to have to search for it. This is going to be a problem. But I'll just land nearby here. That'll be good enough. Right? That'll be good enough. Yeah, sure. So, time to end the episode here for right now. And then we'll go exploring to find that reliquary. So, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so you can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat. Playing games and trying to finish up a whole bunch of missions all at once. And, well, at least get multiple steps into them. And, whoa, that's a big old alien. And uh, exploring new planets and new systems. I guess, as well. Um, we're now on a Viking system in a mission for that. And I'm trying to run down the list of everything we did. Bought a whole bunch of new frigates and... Uh, yeah. Helped a capital ship or two. Mainly just one, but still. Did a lot of good stuff. And we made a lot of money and we spent all of it in one go. So... Oh, yeah, bought a new ship. Yeah, there's that. So, we'll just continue doing what we're doing. There's a guy over there. I guess we'll talk to him in the next episode. For you!